Hi there, time for another video. Um, again, uh, we've got some football cards here, but this time not uh, match attacks. These are the original set of Premier League 2016-17 uh, Tops Now cards. Um, there were 117, I believe, 116 produced in this set. Uh, we can see there we've got all 117. These were produced each week um, to commemorate sort of a big event that had happened in the Premier League, whether it was a comeback or someone's first goal, or there was one here for number four. You can see there was Zlatan Ibrahimovic scores the 25,000th goal in the Premier League. You can see also on the list that we've made up here, there's a list of the print runs. Uh, you can see in the current Tops Now sets, there are many that go into the thousands, even some into the tens of thousands. Uh, so you can see how rare some of these cards are. Some of them go as low, you can see very few go over 100. And some you can see they're 48, 46, 38, 40, 39. I think there's a, th there's a 36, I think there might even be one that goes in as low as 30, yeah, 34. You can see there Tom Carroll, Swansea against Stoke City, uh, number 34 on there for card 95. So you can see some of these are going to be pretty rare indeed. Um, interested to see what you guys think about the value of these. Obviously, we never sell any of the cards, so it's kind of irrelevant. But there are people buying sort of rookie cards for 17, 18, 19-year-old kids who think that in a few years' time they're going to be worth hundreds. Um, but interesting to see um, how what you guys think. If there's... 8, 10, 15, 20,000 of a card, how rare that card actually is. If there's 80 or 100 of a card, clearly that's a far rarer card, but I guess a lot of people don't seem to think there's value in a card that has low numbers. It's more a larger number card in terms of production. Uh, seems to be the desirable card at the moment, rather than a card that might have, say, for instance, this card here had a print run of 209 in this collection. That's one of the highest. Uh, but if we have a look at what we've got, we've got Vincent Janssen for Tottenham. And then we've got Romelu Lukaku for Everton. Ashley Barnes for Burnley. And then we've got the card I spoke about before, 25,000th goal in the Premier League, scored by Zlatan Ibrahimovic. I think this is the highest print run in this set and it has 225 and then this one Jermaine Defoe 150th goal for Jermaine Defoe that had a print run of only 76 which again seems crazy and we've got a Harry Kane there this again a print run of 126 which again is a fairly high print run for this set and we've got Kapu and we've got Divock Origi, 125 of those. And we've got Swansea City. Victor Moses. Nathan Ake, in what must have been a fairly early card for him. 117 print run. Tottenham. Tottenham do seem to feature fairly heavily in this collection. And Vardy hits three. Again, 144 for that Vardy one. Then we've got Jeff Hendrick. Mkhitaryan. Ashley Williams. Courtois, obviously back when he was at Chelsea. 114 print run. So Solomon Rondon. Alvaro Negredo. Joe Rodriguez. Manchester City, and then we've got Chelsea, 12 wins in a row for the Blues. So as you can see, quite obviously a lot of these um, cards commemorate some fairly interesting things, but again, just don't seem to have, or didn't at the time anyway, seem to have the demand for the cards. Troy Deeney, West Ham United, Hammers put four past Swans. Obviously a Boxing Day card there. And then we've got Wijnaldum at Liverpool. This card is number 25, and that had a print run of 117. 
then on to the next ones we've got Paul Pogba again obviously a big name so a slightly higher print on 133 but still definitely not massive Robson Carnu Giroud seems like forever ago that he played for Arsenal and then we've got Valencia and then we've got Aguero there even Aguero only 112 in the print run and Peter Crouch again 94 of those produced Angel Rangel Deli Ali again in what must have been fairly early um, card for Deli Ali at Tottenham 2016-17 um, the print run of that was 128 Joey Barton Abel Hernandez We've got another Harry Kane card there. The print run on that was 98, so not even 100 for Harry Kane. Just shows how Tops now has changed over the last three or four years. Um, Andy Carroll. Tom Davis. Again, uh, must be a fairly early one in Tom Davis's time playing football. Benica Fobate. And a card featuring Rain Rooney. So we we'll just have a look at the print run of that was 332. So that I'm pretty certain must be the uh, the highest one print run in this set. Record breaking Rooney, 250th goal for the club. And then we've got Swansea City. Chris Brunt. We've got Alexis Sanchez again. It seems like forever ago that he played for Arsenal. And even that card only made 99, so not even a hundred print run for that one. And Crystal Palace, Gilfie Sigurdsson, Watford. Another Peter Crouch card doing his famous dance. And then we'll just have a look and see. What that one, the print run on that one was again 80. And Gabriel Jesus for Manchester City. Again, 118 print run on that. Eden Hazard. And again, let's have a look at what Hazard was in terms of print run. 98, so again, not even 100. I mean, imagine a player like Hazard these days having a top nail card and not getting 100 in the print run. It would be... Absolutely crazy. And on to the next pile. We've got Sunderland, again, back when they were in the Premier League. And Dai. West Ham. Sadio Mane. And obviously, Liverpool, I would say, are by far the most collected cards in any collection. And even this Mane card had a print run of 63. Absolutely amazing. Gabby Adini, West Brom, Robbie Brady, Alfie Mawson, and we've got Cesc Fabregas, a print run of 58 on that card. Van Arnholt, Lukaku, print run of 80. Third Harry Kane card. This time a print run of 106. Oritz. Andros Townsend. Leicester City. Leicester City Revival continues. That had a print run of 44. A Liverpool card. Again, going back to Liverpool being probably the most collected cards anywhere in the world. 45 print run for that one. Nathan Redmond. Josh King, Marnie Ass, Craig Dawson, Benica Fobe again, Gary Cahill, so a quick look at that, print run of 53. Again, Leicester City featuring as a team, print run of 39. Manchester United, again, one of the biggest clubs in the world. Print run for that one of 73 with a 600th Premier League 
win again you would have thought a card commemorating such a triumph like that would have been a big one but obviously not then philip coutinho again a print on a 38 absolutely crazy by what the print runs are now and then we've got tottenham and the print run on that was 56 crystal palace Nokia and Didi, and then the card featuring Eden Hazard, again a print run of 40. Hull City, Tottenham, Philip Coutinho, again a print run of 48. Jordi Classy, West Ham. Marcus Alonso, Tom Davis featuring again, print run of just 36, and then Everton, and then we've got Shakiri, back in his Stoke days, Kasri, Vincent Company, again a print run of just 44, and then Rashford, and again this must have been a very early card for Marcus Rushford and this one only had a print run of 71. Bournemouth, Klukas, Tom Carroll, Ben Teke, Jakubovic, Sigurdsson, Pedro, again a big name, a pretty big club, 49 print run. And then we've got Tottenham with Harry Kane and Deli Alley featuring there. Print run of 79. And then finally on to the last few cards. We've got Emre Chan there. Print run of 65. Lanzini. David Silva. Half century of City goals. And again, a fairly big milestone print run of just 46. Sunderland there with Jermaine Defoe, Fernando Lorente, Arsenal ending the run, Chelsea, uh, a card that obviously commemorates them being champions with only a print run of 83, seems again unbelievably low, Swansea complete the mission, Wilfred Zaha, we've got Daniel Sturridge, and then Tottenham farewell to the lane. Uh, again, a fairly high run, 183. High run for this collection, but in terms of modern day Tots now cards, very low. And we've got Chelsea, record breaking blues lift the title. Again, the print run of that is just 59. John Terry, in his final season. And Chelsea, so again, you would think that would have a big print run, but no, just 49. Liverpool into Europe's elite. So again, 114. And then 115 for Josh Harrop for a dream debut. And again, finally, Harry Kane, Golden Boot, with just 116 in the print run. So as you can see there are a lot of big names and a lot of big events in that series but print runs are just so low by comparison it just shows how much things have changed how people are becoming with obsessed with rookies i'm pretty certain that the rashford card from here um, is a rookie card number 92 with a print run of just 71 so that must be a pretty rare card people who think that 8 10 15 thousand cards of a, a rookie player these days is going to be worth a fortune really just don't comprehend and how that's going to be the case because all the people that want them are going to buy them there's not going to all of a sudden be half a million people that want a card in 50 years 20 10 years time it just seems crazy but yeah just an interesting little look at how tops now has evolved um so please obviously keep checking out the videos like subscribe and we'll see you soon